Good morning, boys and girls. So today we're starting with a new application that we want to learn in ICT classes. We are going to talk about Keynote. As you can see, this is my iPad and there is the Keynote application. When I click on it, I will find all these amazing uh, looking templates that we can use. And then we should click on continue and then create a presentation. Okay, so let's start discussing by discussing what is the importance of using a keynote and knowing all the very nice cool features that we can use for. It's not only for making a simple presentation, you can make so many um, fun things with it to represent any work that you want to do. I know that most of you knows um, the basics. But let's discuss this in details. I'm going to show you, inshallah, very nice, cool features that you can use in your uh, subjects, different subjects for different researches. Okay, so these are the themes that I can choose from. So choose whatever you think is nice, whatever you think suits you. So I'm just going to go for this one, the Academy. Let's see how that goes. Okay, so now it's downloading. Okay, so now after I opened my new presentation, I have chose um, the theme that I want to use. I want to show you some cool stuff that you can uh, do with it. So basically on the left, you will have the slides uh, where you can find all the slides uh, starting from slide number one. If you click on the plus button over here you will find an option to add a slide so you can add different templates you can add different layouts you can add bulletin points you can add you can scroll down to add uh, any of the layouts that you want for example if you want to choose this so the second slide is going to use to be used sorry for adding a picture so going back to the first one and on the top you will find different options to uh, change the background any color of your choice so this is how you do it you can change the title you can add on the title or you can mm -hmm. you can add a title or you can add a body for your text perfect and then you can add also slide number so you can see on the bottom right of the slide we can find it okay so other cool things that you can do you can write down using the very cool apple pencil uh, from the bottom you can choose the color of the drawing or the writing and if you want a crayon or a pencil or a marker so presentation why we can use this we can use this either to make uh, drawings some cool drawings to our presentation okay you can also use that for making some highlights explanation and different annotation to your presentation so that makes it a really cool option okay so i'm just going to just play with more okay cool stuff that you can use with this feature and after you're done you basically just click on done okay now okay now on the top also you will find the play button the play button will let you to uh, navigate highlight or exit the slideshow using these uh, very cool options so to navigate you have to, to swipe or tap to highlight you have to touch and hold and to exit the slideshow you have just to pinch it a little bit okay so i'm just going to pinch now so i have exit the slideshow one more time i want to tap 
okay starting from the beginning so tapping I'm just tapping now tapping forward and with the pencil I can also highlight cool stuff as you can see to my presentation okay so pinching to exit perfect what else we can do we can do uh, a back if we don't want to do the things that we just did so you can go back as much as you want you can change the slide view this is how it looks like if you have like 10 slides and you want to see them all at the same time so you can do this or if you want to use the slide view okay one more option I wanted to discuss with you today is this sorry these three little dots that looks really tiny but will give us so many options to use so we're going to discuss just a few options over here you can share your presentation so for example if you were done with the presentation the teacher asked you and then you want to share it via Edmodo to submit the work so you click on share and then here you go you'll, you can find Edmodo you click on it you have to wait a little bit so it will connect you want to send it as an assignment or you save it to the library to share to the class so you have so many options to do that I'm just gonna um, cancel it you can airdrop it with your friends you can send it through email or share it via the drive okay going back also to these options you can export to PDF to movie to animation so different themes you can use as well and you can set let's say a password for your presentation if you want to, to send this presentation for a friend and you want the friend to have the security so you can type down let's say whatever you want the password with and then you can provide the password for your friend okay I just click on cancel and also what you can do is you can print the presentation in the best layout you want to do so this is it for now I just wanted to explore the options that you have for Keynote let's play around with Keynote explore the options try them by ourselves and next class inshallah I'm going to explain to you what does it mean a master slide and what do you want to do in the master slide please stay um, on the main page of ICT um, and follow up with all the assignments I'm going to assign for you I hope you enjoyed you enjoyed it today and see you next class